I'm thinking of the time. Remember when we were at K-Rock, Gary, and you went on that cruise, and they got to see the Red Hot Chili Peppers. Was that it? Was that the right it, thing? We, we weren't on a cruise. We were um, up <clears throat> in uh, the North Pole. Wow. Clear your throat, Gary. Go ahead. I'm good. No, it sounds like you have a little phlegm in there. <clears throat> there it is. Okay, good. I think I feel fine. You do? Oh, okay. <clears throat> Just concerned. Um, uh. We stayed in the area. We stayed on a Russian ice cutter. Then we took a helicopter to the actual magnetic North Pole, which I think people like, Pay a lot of money to just get out, put a flag down to say they were at the top of the world. Magnetic North Pole? What the fuck are you talking about? That's straight <clears> at the <throat> top of the world. Why do you call it Magnetic North Pole? You're That's the only what they kept saying. Heard? That's what they kept saying. I just... Well, why so, did you say I, 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 Like, there must be a North Pole and a Magnetic North Pole, and you're not really on the North Pole. <laughs> like, we, wow. you're near the North Pole, but if you go to the Magnetic North Pole, you're really on the North Pole. Gary. So you were you were on the magnetic North Pole, not the real North Pole. <laughs> I don't know where it was. So close. <laughs> Gary! I have no idea. The Red Hot Chili Pepper show was on an army base. I think it was a hundred people. And it was I mean it was, it was tiny. They probably got paid a fortune to do in it. The a nor- uh, you know, and they had to go to the North Pole to do it. It's no. not like they Robin. walked out of their house and they performed for 100 people. <laughs> they didn't even go to the North Pole. They went to the magnetic North Pole, whatever the <laughs> fuck that is. That's what they kept telling us. You know, Gary, your teeth are so big. Did the magnets at the North Pole mess with your fillings? Like, did they start flying out? No, everything was fine. (laughs) I don't like that Gary says magnetic North Pole like he's some sort of expert. He didn't even know what it is. I know. He doesn't know where he was. He doesn't know why he was. (laughs) I'm I'm not bragging about it. I'm telling you, that's where they told us. No, I don't like that you said you were at the magnetic North Pole. But that's where I was. You you were at the North Pole. Just say the North Pole. I remember when we flew, we went above something that they call the tree line. And it's just like, there's, it's like literally you can see from the plane, it's just like green stuff just stops growing. Uh oh, there's the green line. Oh, I better tell Paul. Uh oh, hope we make it to the Red Hot Chili Peppers show. Gary. <laughs> Look, Paul, no more green. <laughs> Boss, one minute I was looking at green. And the next minute, I wasn't looking at anything. I, saw I mean, that's what it is. <clears throat> yeah. <clears throat> I'm a world traveler. Uh-oh. Can't wait till we get to that magnetic North Pole. I love <laughs> magnetic anything. It's a real place, the North Magnetic Pole. It's a real place. No, magnetic North Pole. I feel like buoy Magellan. Did you know that the only green I saw after the tree line was the green on my teeth? <laughs> I saw that one coming like a fucking haymaker. You saw it like you saw the tree line. <laughs> By the way, there is four magnetic North Poles. Could you guess which one I was at? Hey, Fred, if you can break character for a minute. Do you, yeah. Did you know there was a magnetic North Pole? You probably knew that. I did know there was a magnetic North Pole, yeah. Yeah. And it, it's, it's very unclear as to where it is, because apparently with the Earth, it shifts. It's moving. That's right. They say it's moving fast. Everyone will be excited to know Gary Audiobook is on the uh, phone and wants to share his story <laughs> oh. with us about the magnetic North Pole. Go ahead, Gary, Audiobook. This is my list of the most amazing things that I've got to do that I thought I would never do because I was involved with the show. So, number one, seeing the Red Hot Chili Peppers play on the North Pole. Got invited mm. to uh, one of those gigs where they did it was for Molson. Magnetic North My Pole. wife and I went. We were on a Russian ice cutter and going by icebergs and everything. And then we went and saw the Red Hot Chili Peppers with 150 people. It was great. Wow. Thanks, uh, Gary Audiobook. <laughs> Why in your book did you say North Pole? And here you explain Magnetic North Pole. Uh, I don't know, Howard. Maybe because I was just trying to be more precise for you. Mm. All right. Here, I'll read from this science book. The Earth is one big magnet. The magnetic North Pole is also known as the North Dip Pole. It moves miles every year. Yeah. Uh, who gives a fuck? I feel like I'm back at school. <laughs> they had to go zoning. find it, Howard. <laughs> they were like, are we there yet? Nope, nope, nope. It moved. 